dial bore gauge will directly read the diameter of deep holes with exceptional accuracy. They take a two-point measurement over a specific range with interchangeable tips. Today we will look at the Starrett model 3089Z 131715J. It can measure holes between 0.7 to 1.5 inches with a resolution to half a thousandth. The gauge uses a combination of interchangeable anvils and spacers along with a precise dial indicator. Let's see how this works. This part has a bore with a specified size of 0.750 inches with a tolerance of plus or minus five thousandths. The first step is to select the correct anvil by going to the gauge chart in the user manual. The column on the right lists hole size ranges. The range for our application is 0.740 to 0.780. The chart indicates that we need the 0.7 inch anvil along with the 0.02 and 0.04 inch spacers. Now remove the screw, which is the 0.7 anvil, from the fixed foot of the gauge. Then put the 0.02 and 0.04 spacers on the 0.7 anvil and reattach finger tight with a wrench. Next, set the gauge to a standard. We will use a 0.750 inch setting ring. With the dial face forward so you can read it, tilt it so the contacts are at an angle and move the gauge into the setting ring. Slightly rock the gauge back and forth and adjust the dial face to exactly zero when the dial is at its minimum position. Now let's measure. Hold the gauge at an angle and carefully move it into the hole until the tip is about a half inch deep. Watching the indicator dial, slowly move the bore gauge parallel to the hole. Rock it slightly to find the point where the dial is at its smallest value. Here we see that the size measures minus two thousandths on the dial, definitely within tolerance. Now, rock the gauge back at an angle and carefully withdraw it from the hole. Disassemble the 0.7 anvil and spacers from the gauge and put them back into their proper places. With attention to detail and some practice, the bore gauge will measure your tight tolerance holes with accuracy and repeatability.